Eh bien, ça tu me c'est pour une nouvelle vidéo sur WW2K16 sur PS4 pour le PVP euh, Roadblock. Roadblock. Euh, je crois que ça se dit ainsi logiquement. D'abord, je tiens à signaler, c'est le, bah, le PVP du mois de mars, parce qu'il n'y a pas de PVP au mois de mars. Le seul PVP qu'il y aura, c'est bah, vos chemins en avril. D'abord, ce que la WW a décidé de faire, c'est bah, un autre PVP. C'est-à-dire, au lieu de, du fast line qu'on avait eu. Non, au lieu de. Ouais, fast line qu'on avait eu à cette époque. Mais non, c'est. Oui, non, au lieu de INS, euh, pas INS, euh, comment que c'est déjà euh, ce qu'on avait à la place de Fastline qu'avant euh, Je ne sais plus aller euh, éliminer chez Chamber. Ben, en fait, ils ont refait un autre PVP, c'est euh, Roadblock. Ouais. Euh, D'abord, ce sera euh, exclusivement, à ce, qui, à ce que j'ai pu comprendre, ce serait exclusivement pour, euh, euh, la, ben, pour euh, sur le W Network. D'abord, si vous avez le W Network, ben, vous pouvez le regarder... Euh, le 12, d'abord, logiquement, ce sera le 12, d'abord, c'est pas dimanche, c'est le samedi. D'abord, je sais plus de quelle heure à quelle heure, je crois que c'est la même heure que d'habitude. Parce que moi, j'ai l'habitude de regarder sur, une, sur, euh, bah, sur le, le, le network, bah, ça devrait être bon. Mais voilà, c'est samedi, logiquement, si je dis pas de conneries. Et je ne sais pas maintenant s'il y aura une... Euh, par exemple, si en France, vous en France, vous allez avoir euh, le live le dimanche, quoi, ou le samedi, je ne sais pas. Je ne pense pas parce que c'est spécifié du bout de network. Et vu que j'ai dit que je ferai tous les, les PVP... Ben, je, voilà, je vais faire celui-là parce que ben, pour moi, il faut que je le fasse. C'est la première fois qu'il sera au début du mois parce que, ben oui, même moi, je, ça me fait bizarre de le faire au début du mois. Ben, début le 12, quoi. D'abord, euh, là, d'habitude, c'est toujours euh, le, chaque euh, dimanche de chaque mois, de fin de mois. Et là, ben, c'est au début. Ben, là, c'est la double qu'on a décidé ainsi, d'abord. Avant de commencer, je vais vous dire les matchs qu'il y a. D'abord, j'en ai rajouté quelques-uns parce que ben, ça me semblait vide. Et j'ai été voir sur euh, une, la page web. Attendez, je vais quand même la refresh au cas où. Pour vraiment être sûr que ça soit bien ça. Attendez, hop, je refresh la page. Attendez, hop. Voilà, ouais. De base, il y a 4 matchs. De base. Moi, je n'ai rajouté un parce qu'il devrait y être. Ouais, non. Je vais je, je le laisser parce que pour moi, il devrait y être. Parce que c'est une rivalité qui date depuis trop longtemps. En fait. Attendez, mais quel match qui manque d'abord Ah oui, non, je n'ai rajouté deux plutôt, pas un. Parce qu'en fait, il, y avait, il manque en fait, il manquait un match. D'abord, euh, parce qu'en fait, il y a un match qui ne sera pas mis. Euh, ce sera, euh, c'est un match de NXT. D'abord, il ne sera pas mis lui parce qu'il manque deux personnages. Voilà. D'abord, il y aura euh, The New Day vs euh, Bad News Barrett et Sheamus. Moi, j'ai mis pour les titres parce que ben, pour moi, euh, voilà, je pense que c'était pour les titres. Puis, c'est celui que j'ai rajouté. Voilà, attendez, d'ailleurs, il n'y a même pas le chiffre 2. Voilà. Euh, celui que j'ai rajouté, Sami Zayn vs Kevin Owens pour, ce, pour le titre. Parce que pour moi, ben, euh, vu qu'il ben, y a une très grosse rivalité de, qui pèse depuis longtemps avec eux, ben, il devrait avoir le match. Bon, moi je l'ai mis. Puis, l'autre match que j'ai rajouté encore une fois, c'est euh, Kalisto vs Reback pour le titre. Et puis, c'est euh, l'avant-dernier match, c'est Brock Lesnar vs Bray Wyatt qui est validé lui. Et le main event, c'est Triple H vs... vs Dean Ambrose pour le titre de la WWE, du World Heavyweight oui, oui, Champion de la WWE, voilà. C'est plus long à dire, mais c'est, voilà. D'abord, on se retrouve juste après parce que j'ai oublié de faire un truc, d'abord. Et... Bien, voilà, genre, on est parti, d'abord. Comme vous pouvez le voir, on est sur une arène, euh, une arène créée, voilà. Malheureusement, parce que ben, je ne pouvais pas mettre d'autres trucs. C'est un peu bizarre parce qu'il y a le logo bizarre WWE, mais l'ancien. Bon, voilà, ça, je ne peux rien y faire, c'est, voilà, c'est... Vous avouez que là, c'est, voilà. Mais voilà, j'ai dû euh, le faire moi-même. Et d'ailleurs, ça, ça, euh, ce pay-per-view-là se déroule au Toruto au Canada d'abord euh, voilà c'était le petit euh, voilà c'était le moment euh, que j'avais retenu ben, tout à l'heure Sinon, voilà, je n'ai fait que ça, moi. Four of 
WWE's finest squaring off in what will assuredly be an exciting tag team encounter. There's no denying that this is a tremendous tag team combination. It reminds me of the old APA. Man, both of these teams are determined to walk away with a win. Something's got to give. This is one of the most talked about entrances in all of WWE. And introducing the challengers, Bad News Barrett and the Celtic Warrior, Sheeman. And their opponents, they are the WWE Tag Team Champions, Kofi Kingston and Big E. The new. Uh, we are seconds away from the start of this title match. Bon, on est parti d'abord. Je suis Kofi Kingston pour ce que nous D'abord, il y a plus de New Day. Parce que, ben, entre la, la Ligue des Nations et le New Day, ben, je permets le New Day. Et puis ce qui s'est passé à Fastlane avec Edge et Chris Kyo qui étaient avec eux, bah, c'était ultra fort. Mais... Bah, ultra rigolo. Can you imagine the celebration that will take place probably into the wee hours of the morning? If we crown a new champion here tonight, well, taking a look at Kofi Kingston, what's the lowdown here? The prestige of holding a singles title certainly hasn't been lost. Just look at the ferocity in which these two are competing. And Kofi's having some fun now. What a punch! What a challenge! On esquive, et là. When we talk about one of the most exciting, thrilling, and enthusiastic superstars in WWE, Kofi Kingston is definitely on top of the list. Kofi is a human highlight reel, and no one ever knows what aerial mastery he'll perform next. Uh, you can say that again, Cole. Since his early days in WWE, Kofi's boundless energy and athleticism has made him one of the most beloved superstars anywhere in the world. Ah, génial. Oh, and a terrific reversal. A 
can't help but think of his risk of internal injuries at this point in time. Yeah, this could get real serious. Ah, il va pas chercher, il me... Oh God, that was hitting the nail right on the head. If he takes many more of those, he's going to get lit up like a Christmas tree. Kobe Kingston's brand of aerial attacks makes him one of the most famous high flyers in all of sports entertainment. Kobe's athleticism has provided audiences some of the most astounding displays of physical skill ever seen in a 20 by 20 foot ring. Turning it around, it's Kobe Kingston with the reversal. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Quick thinking to avoid that. Le canet de tour, hein, frère. Kenny, Kofi's provided so many memorable moments that the fans can remember each one and know that when the Wildcats Lico. name is announced, they're going to see something they've never, ever seen before. Knee lift! If his back wasn't hurt before, it certainly is now. Yeah, and it's going to be hurting for a while. Oh, and he's going to have to do something big here. His partner is in bad shape. Oh my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. Allez, pour le. Non mais. Je fais le même geste. This match is going to be so unpredictable. I just can't wait. Bad news: Barrett is a merciless striker who shatters opponents' bones with clotheslines, boots, punches, knee lifts, and wasteland. It's why he calls it the Barrett Barrage. Bad news: Barrett just runs through opponents. This will be a physical battle. You're right about that, Cole. This is going to be a war. This could be so physical that it gets really ugly before it's over. Hey, that's a flip back off. There can only be one top dog here in the WWE, and a win here will go a long way in solidifying one of these guys' claims of being the best in the business. King, you said it earlier, and it's undeniable. Bad News Bill truly has one of the most diverse arsenals in the game, and don't forget about that big boot of his, King. Yeah, forget it. When that's Ash, the running body block. Ooh, that was brutal. the tag to Kofi Kingston. What an insane move by Big E. There it is, the finisher. This could all be over right now. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Oh, sérieux? Excuse-moi, personne ne peut se dégager que ça, justement. Oh, they couldn't find a home for that one. Well, it certainly wasn't due to a lack of trying, Michael. Showing no signs of letting up. And there's the control frenzy. Kofi Kingston from out of nowhere. Oh, man, we. Oui. trop parié, ça, tu vois. Ça, c'était vraiment à sentir, tu vois. He makes the tag. He desperately, desperately needs to make a tag here. Not today. Too fast. Oh my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damage ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. So damaging. Much more of that, and he's not going to last long. Sheamus shows us some clever offense here. Taking this type of punishment must be damaging to his sternum. Damaging to his entire chest. Oh, the call. Oh, yeah. Uh, what a shot, Kofi. 
Il n'a pas le temps, euh, voilà. Ah oh oui, d'accord, le mec qui me fait un petit coup de pied, puis il marche en dessous. And Kingston has an answer for that one. You know, my jaw always seems to hit the floor at least once per Kofi Kingston match. This guy's unreal. Look out, here comes Kofi. You know, Kofi Kingston has the athleticism to keep things going in there and take off whatever he feels like it. That shouldn't surprise anyone. Going for the big one. And the Jamaica nails the buzzsaw. He's setting it up. Kingston's about to seal the deal. Trouble in paradise does it. Kofi Kingston, that's his vintage move. Tu sens le rock book là. Mais c'est une blague. Deux fois il se dégage d'un truc, s'il te plaît. Mais deux finishes, quoi, s'il te plaît. Pas un, mais deux. Ah, mais je comprends pourquoi il utilise cette finish. Il avait une finish et il utilise pour se dégager. Bon après je peux pas contrer d'abord. Euh, de contrer un mec que je ne peux pas contrer. And now he's back out on the apron. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Sheamus turns it around. <laughs> For a big guy, Sheamus sure is sneaky. Just toying with the competition a little. Cole, what's he got in mind? Sheamus has given a beaten and taken one here tonight. Whether you want to admit it or not, the Celtic Warriors' ability to fight is like no other and can keep him alive in any match. Astonishing maneuver by Sheamus. It's nearly impossible to deal with this type of power. His partner's been... And the referee's counts interrupted there. Well, it just goes to show you that an attack can come from anywhere where you're in that ring. Oh, wow. Whoa! A direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and knocked in the middle of... L'arbitre compte. Bah oui, deux ans quoi, s'il te plaît. The referee getting involved now. Good red suplex. This guy's just too strong. Quick thinking to avoid that. He's setting it up. C'est bon. Sheamus. Oh, that's got to be hit. Sheamus, how about that finishing move? That hand had a lot of force behind it. And there's the tag. And he has to make a tag to his fresh partner. So punishing. Big E showing that he knows good and well the mental game is just as important as the physical game. Il va pas se dégager parce que il reste encore assez bien de. Not today, too fast. Feeling we're going to see several more demonstrations like that before the night's over. Watching this beating, we can only wonder what kind of attack is next. If I were this guy, I'd stick with this attack. Oh, out of nowhere! And Big E manages to reverse out of that one. It's a long way down from there. A quick reversal by Sheamus. And off the tag is Barrett. There's the clothesline. And he finally gets out of the ring. We're a 
looking at complete domination here. He gets the tag. Ah bah, ça c'est toi ou chez nous ce qu'il prête, c'est pareil pour moi. And the right body block from Big E should seal the deal here. Hard to come back from that. You're right, you may not get up for a week after that. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. Oh, sérieux. Mais la chatte qui l'a, s'il te plaît. Sheamus sneaks out of that one. And I'm sure that was just pure instinct on Sheamus's part. Even if you can get back to your feet after a move like that. At this stage of the match, you're still struggling to find your balance. Quick pin! Hey, is this it? Uh, it may be. Holding out here. Oh, wait, nice reversal. Quit running your mouth and let them do this thing. Very impressive. Kingston can steal the show on any given night. Kofi Kingston with the offense. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. Kofi Kingston's treating this place like his own private amusement park. Kofi's feeling it again. Oh l'arbitre m'a fait trop trop peur là. Mais ouais. Et de base, je lui saute dessus là. Je saute sur le faux équipé de base. Wow! What a drop kick! And he fails to connect with anything that time. Man, that was some miss, all right. I can feel the breeze all over. Oh non! Oh, they're taking a risk. Shane has hit that one. Oh shit. And there's the count. And now he goes for it a second time. Quick thinking to avoid that. Scaling the turnbuckle, Kofi Kingston, watch out! Going toe to toe here. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right, that was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. The tension, the drama, this is electric. Look at the back of my arm, Cole, look at the goosebumps, I love this. Et c'est la fin de ce que je fais, c'est parti. I can't remember a more highly anticipated title defense. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Could this be it? I think so. Two. Oh, there's another hit. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. Oh, there it is. We now have and he makes it. Ah, trop parié, ça, tu vois. The referee getting involved. And the shoulders up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. You can tell Sheamus does not want to lose to this guy. Whoa! A direct hit. Talk about getting Black. tagged and knocked in the middle of next week. Hey! He's going for it again! Okay, le mec qui sort sa, 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 sa spécial comme ça, tu sais. Astonishing maneuver by Sheamus. Oh man, I thought he might have been knocked out right there. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. They got it. Well, I don't know how you can pick out highlights from that match. The whole match was highlights. 
logiquement là ça devait être fini pour du bon en fait logiquement de base quand ils font cette prise là ils doivent le mettre KO de base voilà mais bon d'abord euh, dans le ligue des nations champions Il revient pas trop là, tu vois. Parce que, euh, ben voilà. Je pensais qu'il aurait été avec déjà euh, Barrett qui prend 3-4 finishers quand même. Voilà. D'abord, il y a un moment donné où ce qu'il faut respecter. Mais c'est Kofi qui a pris plus. Hein. Il a pris plusieurs brokis aussi. Et c'est là, là, hop. Là, je, je, je voulais pas faire le truc que je voulais. Là, hop, le mec il m'a attrapé. Puis voilà. Bon, on se retrouve pour le prochain match. Hein, bon, euh, voilà. Je vous laisse euh, la cinématique et tout. Et voilà. to see the ripple effects this win has in the weeks to come. D'abord, nous sommes partis pour le match Sami Zayn vs Kevin Owens pour un Extreme Rules match. Et c'est parti. Bon, voilà. Pour Extreme Rules, parce que je me dis qu'il faut que ça se règle entre deux et les Extreme Rules pour vraiment que tout soit réglé je pense voilà pour le titre intercontinental surtout the following contest is an extreme rules match and it is for the intercontinental championship ovation from this crowd here tonight. You're looking at somebody whose career could change forever with the win over the champion here tonight. This match is going to be exciting. I can almost guarantee it. Calling this one's going to be a real treat, Michael. And I know you feel the same way. Yep, so does King.
challenger from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 205 pounds, Sammy Zayn. And his opponent from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, he is the intercontinental champion, Kevin Owens. So much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. And there's the bell. These guys are going to be. Hit. The shoulders are down. And the shoulders are down. The 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 je sais pas trop des où qui peut être mais voilà on va dire Kevin Owens Let's get your take on him Definitely looking confident in this 101 environment We're going to find out a lot here tonight head to head no excuses Let's get it on I assure you that hurts Man Kevin Owens what offense Well we're on the move here bon frère I'm not sure I can watch this. With the championship at stake, you know these superstars will get everything they have to win here tonight. Oh, that goes without saying. Cole. The WWE Championship. It's what it's all about here in the WWE. Every superstar wants to be the champion, and tonight's match is no exception. Back down to earth. Et voilà, c'est parce que j'ai vu une mise à jour Steam euh, qui me demandait de redémarrer mon PC. Je veux dire, ben non. Je en vidéo, hein, Kevin Owens made a Et en parlant de ça, euh, euh, si vous voulez acheter le jeu de catch 2016 sur PC, euh, il y a une première le 11. Et vous que la vidéo sort demain, parce que moi on est le 11, on est le 12, mais euh, euh, d'abord si vous voulez l'acheter, il y aura le lien dans les dans les si vous voulez le jeu, il a une très très grosse sur gaming, voilà. Et peut-être que d'ailleurs je me le prendrai sur PC pour faire les PVP sur PC, mais il faut que j'achète le truc pour avoir euh, tout débloqué en fait. Comme ça, ben, j'ai plus facile pour moi faire mes trucs, et peut-être que ce sera plus beau. Ah d'accord, le mec qui me laisse pas le temps de mettre la table sur lui. Shows us some clever offense here. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Oh, out of nowhere! What's he gonna do here? What's he gonna do here? Turning it around, it's Sami Zayn. Je connais pas trop les prises de Sami Zayn pour ceux qui se demandent. À part sa fameuse prise entre les poteaux. Voilà, parce que ça annonce un jour de foot. D'abord, il aime bien être les poteaux. Mais entre le poteau plutôt. Et pas les poteaux. Ah, petit fail. Ok, ça fait plaisir. Alors, tu me donnes la table. C'est pas pour les petits. C'est la dernière fois que tu avais voulu prendre une table. C'était à contre des nombreuses et t'étais passé à travers deux tables. D'abord, voilà. You felt that go right through the body. You may not agree with this form of attack, but it's very smart. Now, time will tell if that'll be enough to win the match. He's sending Oula. a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Kevin Owens. Oh, Man, Kevin Owens. Well, we're on the move here. C'était euh, violent quand même. Bon, faudrait peut-être que je mette des coups parce que là il est dans le jaune et moi je suis dans le rouge. Donc voilà.
You have to wonder what's going through these guys' minds in a match of this magnitude. No, oh, wait, nice reversal. Oh, head first. You can practically feel the wear and tear that's been done throughout this match. You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike. And that nailed him. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. Sami Zayn is conjuring up some good momentum here. C'était beau ça. Oh mais non mais je the déteste les captures qui sont crevées comme ça et qui te mettent un petit coup comme ça. Oh his presence felt there. Oh out here you have to be able to think on your feet lightning fast. One mistake, one moment of hesitation and you could find yourself in a world of hurt. He's too busy bragging and boasting the battle into this matchup. That strike hit the spot. There's no way he could have avoided that blow. You have to respect that Kevin Owens knows what he wants and goes right after it. He's one of the most no-nonsense competitors we've seen in a long time. Yeah, but I'm not so sure Sami Zayn respects that. Mm -hmm. Kevin Owens wanted Zayn's NXT title and cut to the front of the line in February 2015 to take it. Je ne sais pas comment il se met pas sur la table, s'il te plaît. Allez, Kevin. Non, mais pas What a match! Hey, Kevin Owens n'aime pas les tables, là, ce que je vois. Without question, there's no doubt about how prestigious the Intercontinental Championship is here in the WWE. You're right about that, Cole. It's one of the most prestigious. Ça aurait été plus marrant s'il aurait été sur la table, tu vois. Ah mais non, mais c'est une blague. Et la table ne veut pas de lui. C'est vraiment la table qui veut pas de lui, tu sais. Try to become the Intercontinental Champion. Looking good now. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. When this guy's on, look out. Ah, je déteste le proto. Oh, he missed that one. God, that's gotta hurt. Ah, le coup. Ah, mais non, mais et les les prises de force sont bugués dans ce jeu. C'est pas que je suis méchant, mais euh, des fois le mec il fait un geste, il attend, voilà, comme là, et en fait la prise ne se fait pas des fois, c'est d'abord. Euh... Oh, un double contre. Juste que j'aille voir un truc, c'est que je sais pas c'est quoi c'est fini. Ah, une... ah non, mais laisse tomber la soumission, s'il te plaît, dégage. Euh, voilà. Euh... Ah, en quoi okay. Mais euh, la soumission, tu dégages quoi, si j'y pas quoi. Ah, il a peur, il a peur. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie, he's wild in there. Non mais, oh là là. Non mais, il commence à me gaver là. Et directly on the back. This is going to be brutal. Yeah, that back is in bad shape. Oh, once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. Oh, non, can you can do steel, concrete, the barricades. Ah, uh, OK, il me donne. Kevin Owens shows us. Non mais, tu me gaves là, s'il te plaît, à ah, pareil. Ah oui, oui, d'accord, si tu veux. Ah non mais euh, c'est ultra chiant maintenant pour les mettre contre le poteau, je sais pas mais avant j'avais plus facile à le faire maintenant c'est ultra relou. C'est quoi pour être vraiment qu'ils soient placés Hop. Oh mais Non mais je l'ai vraiment dit hein, que c'était sûr pour le mettre contre le poteau maintenant. I gotta tell you, these guys are in the best shape I've ever seen them in. Là, là s'il est pas contre le poteau, maintenant toi, il faut qu'il soit contre le poteau et qu'il ne bouge plus. You have to assume that tonight is Ah non, me dis pas que c'est dans le ring en fait. There's practically no rules to enforce. Hop là, tiens. C'était gratuit. 
Ou il faudrait avoir trois, mais ça m'étonnerait, c'est tu vois. Ah, mais. Et ça, c'est relou qu'il monte pas dans le ring directement, ça. Euh, c'est. The Intercontinental Championship is on the line. Since 1979, it's been widely considered one of the most prestigious titles in all of sports entertainment. Back between the ropes. Look at this. He's just barely moving. I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. Voilà l'OMG, punaise. Il n'y a plus la table, mais ça c'est rien. Once you get out of the ring, anything can happen. You've got exposed steel, concrete, the barricades, and all of it can be used to cause massive damage. He wants this battle decided inside the ring. And that's why he's such a great athlete, such a, an important superstar. Sami Zayn always finds a way to stay in a match. This superstar is so gifted athletically, and when he had, he thinks he has it. One, two, and the shoulder's up in time. Well, as long as it's up before that three count, that's all that matters. Wow, what a display of heart and determination. Oh, wow. Oh, <laughs> what a shot. Et mon compte, s'il te plaît, ouais. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match. Il peut me terminer là. Il me fait le tomber, il me termine. The shoulders are down. And the shoulders up now. Okay. That's a kick out. Nice. You know it's hard to believe, but it looks like he still has some gas left in his tank. Oh, mama. This may settle the score right here. Sammy Zayn smashes the one. You have to think that Kevin he did it, the winner and your new champion. Nouveau champion en plus. Look at this. This was a match that was simply mesmerizing. We may be looking at the match of the year. Here. Let's check him out. D'abord, voilà, on va se retrouver pour le prochain match qui est Calisto vs Reback pour le titre des États-Unis. Bon, c'est parti. Bah, bon, voilà, on va célébrer la victoire avec. Bah, euh, voilà. We have a new champion. Unbelievable. What a match and a new champion. I love WWE. I'm Nico, and I love our new champion. And on top of that, there's a new champion in the WWE. And it looks to me like our winner is already thinking about the next match. Always one step ahead. Et eh bien voilà, j'en ai parti pour le match Callisto vs Reback pour le titre intercontinental euh, des États-Unis plutôt. Intercontinental c'était avant, mais bon. Voilà, d'abord on est parti et puis voilà, il n'y a plus qu'à que le temps de chargement y aille parce que ben, c'est pas du temps, c'est le temps de chargement qui, qui est avant moi ou après moi. Et ben là c'est l'inverse. Voilà. Bon. Bon, je tiens à signaler que je suis toujours en mode légende en disant euh, voilà mais pas en difficile moi je me suis toujours mis en mode légende parce que ben, je me dis que si j'arrive à gagner ben, je pourrais me battre contre des autres parce que le mode légende est plus dur que dans les anciens sur PS4 ou euh, PS3 voilà. ou même la version PS3 et 360 de, de ce jeu là
wake up. Well, this guy looks eager to add some gold around his waist. Let's see if he can do it. A big fight feel here in the arena as the challenger gets ready for action. This guy will settle for nothing short of a victory here tonight. It's going to take a hell of a show to unseat the United States champion tonight. You're a former United States champ. Yeah. Introducing the challenger from Las Vegas, weighing in at 291 pounds, Ryback! And his opponent from Mexico City, weighing in at 170 pounds, he is the United States Champion, Kalisto! In a few seconds, the wait is over, and we will finally get this match underway. On est parti. This is a one-on-one ah. matchup, and I don't think I have to remind ah, you. Si déjà, uh, voilà. These guys are going to need to show some guts and heart if they hope to leave here with the gold. How the heck does that not leave a competitor paralyzed? Brutal. I'm telling you, that's one of the most vicious things I've ever seen. When it strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. Ah, oui, non, mais si je foire, euh... You can't put a price tag on landing that perfect strike. And that nailed him. Something to keep in mind when you're in the ring with Ryback is to never turn your back on him for an instant. Because his moves have such power and such force behind him that all it takes is one strike from the human wrecking ball to lay you flat on your back. What's your analysis of Kalisto? Actually, let's talk about both competitors. They clearly know the magnitude of this match and both came into this match in tremendous condition. Showing amazing agility here. Whoa! Yeah, this guy is amazing. Look out below! Look out! Boy, he just got laid out. And that scenario King was describing with Ryback is all too familiar. An opponent thinks he has the upper hand of the big guy, and then suddenly, bang! Out comes the meat hook, and Ryback is standing over a limp body. That's exactly right, Michael. Big Hungry executes those killer clotheslines with as much might as anybody in the business. It only takes one to knock his foe into tomorrow. Not today, too fast. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Kalisto. He's too busy bragging and boasting than battling in this matchup. Kalisto's plan has got him on a roll here tonight. Getting some air here. I need some too after sitting next to you.
You know, something that many people don't know about Ryback away from the ring is that his time in the gym, that can't... Oh, look at that. He managed to get a shoulder up. Well, like they say, Cole, timing is everything. Whoa, what the... Look at this. Quelle question, je vais oublier à chaque fois, c'est au coup spécial, en fait. Il y en a qu'en fait, d'accord. Kalisto. Kalisto can create his own momentum so easily that he can amaze an opponent or audience. Camel clutch! He needs to figure out a way to get to his base and break the hole. In the ropes, and that may have been the only escape. Les amis, vous avez entendu mon bruit, c'est normal, c'est mon PC qui. Même mon autre PC qui les a rendus. That's like watching someone be on voit sur le What a slam. It only takes a couple of those to bring his night to an end. King, you brought up Ryback and his time in the gym. Ryback uses that time to reflect on what is going on in WWE as well as outside the The discipline it takes to build a physique like Ryback's requires years and years of dedication and sacrifice. Yeah, and I think Ryback's dedication and thinking in the gym gives us a little more insight into who he really is. The human wrecking ball might be more cerebral in his approach to this business than people realize and give him credit for. What a powerful slam! He is just getting busted up. Kalisto is getting ready. Oh, it's a kick. Kalisto unleashes the Listo kick. Stick a fork in him. He's done. Another big victory, I think, here for Kalisto. But it's not over yet. Look at all this. All his attention and energy is now focused on that arm. Yeah, he's got tunnel vision. You know, a strategy against the back would be... He's got me. He's got me. Horrible. Oh, I wasn't ready. Oh, I wasn't ready. Ah bah c'est sa finish ça, hop Look at Ryback making his move Here we see it one more time Yeah I don't know if I can believe what I saw the first time Quickly into the cover with the title on the line Here we go And it's up, he got the shoulder off C'était chaud là, c'était chaud C'était très chaud même Wow, that was a wild strike. I'm talking about missing the target. Yeah, it looked like it was completely out of desperation. He looks absolutely unstoppable here. Oh, man. The force of that splash was breathtaking. Especially if you're the one being landed on. Oh, d'accord. Okay, make it like this. Revenge. Up. We're looking at complete domination here. How much more? It's not cool. That's the one who's more. To win this match, this is unreal. The strikes have a little extra on them tonight. He's trying to mangle his face here. That was spectacular. He's from my piece. Just okay. keeps getting better, and he's toast. Yeah. Not this. He's looking at it again. The least of kick. Oh, the least of gonna walk out of here with a W, and he deserves it. What a match! For Kalisto, trying to get under his opponent's skin with this one. He sees it. Look out! Selena Del Sol. Kalisto's going to close this out right here. Well, wait a minute, Cole. Don't get the card. Yeah. This thing's not over yet. What a shot in this title kind of defense. Et voilà, genre, on se retrouve pour ce match qui va être énorme. Ce sera Brock Lesnar vs Bray Wyatt. Et c'est parti. Les gars, attendez, je vais juste voir s'il y a pas une. Oh, what a spectacular match! That match was incredible! Parce que je vois, il y a pas de... Ah, les WWE competitors tore this arena apart.
there should be no doubt in anyone's mind that he's the true and deserving champion. Absolutely. What an incredible match. Well, he just showed what being a champion is all about. That was awesome. I don't make them. Et bien voilà, on est parti d'abord pour le match. D'abord, j'ai mis en manager bah, pour Brock Lesnar, euh, Paul, Paul Eman. Et pour le bah, euh, Bray Wyatt, j'ai mis euh, Luke Harper. Voilà. Logiquement, ils doivent. Ah, bon, Bray Wyatt aura peut-être plus de personnes, mais logiquement, Brock Lesnar est avec son. Personne. Avec lui. Pas le droit. You know, sometimes a superstar just has that look in his eye. And this is one of those times. Looking motivated to make an impact here tonight. Entertainment history. Yeah, what's scary is he's just getting started, Cole. I'm afraid to think about how dangerous he'll become. This one is going to be an all out brawl, Michael. Just the way I like it. Parce que c'était pas la bonne entrée logiquement pour Bray Wyatt en fait, c'est surtout ça. Ouais. Bon, on est parti, hein. allez hop, je vois que le snare. Hein. Et là, c'est le bell. Don't be surprised at all if these guys attempt to one up each other. Je me rappelle de la Wyatt euh, Family, ce qu'ils ont fait au Royal Rumble, c'est pour ça que le snare, euh, les expos sinon, il a éliminé tout le monde, hein, lui au Royal Rumble. D'ailleurs, à WrestleMania, Brock Lesnar vs. Dylan Boas. Ça va être hardcore ce match. En plus tout sera permis quoi, un match de rue quoi. Ça va être ultra hardcore quoi. Après ce qui est logique après ce que Brock Lesnar a fait. Ouais. There are a lot of performers who have had a greater number of pay-per-view appearances than Brock Lesnar. But not Mais pas comme Rose s'en sortira vivant quoi. You know, right from his very first year in 2002. When he took down WWE Hall of Famer ah. The Rock at SummerSlam, the beast has taken over. D'ailleurs en parlant du Rock, comme il dit, le Rock sera à WrestleMania 32. Et ça, ça va être Speed, size, agility. Lesnar registers off the charts in all those categories. Yeah, not only is he physical, but he's smart and vicious too. And that makes Brock Lesnar one of the most dangerous men in WWE. Look at the monster that is Brock Lesnar. Brock 
From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. No kidding, this is going to need some serious medical attention. And to your point, King, of the epic pay-per-view events that Brock Lesnar has been a part of, I think it has been SummerSlam, starting with that encounter with The Rock in 02, where the Beast has made his strongest mark. Victories over Triple H and CM Punk in 2012-2013 have made SummerSlam look like Brock's personal playground. Slow he is to react. Uh, right oh, Good lord, that wasn't even close. So that's what it's like being so far off the mark. What we're witnessing here is surreal. The beast, Brock Lesnar, is lethal as is. But now it's like he's running on unlimited energy. He's impervious to pain. This is when an anatomical juggernaut like Brock Lesnar is even more dangerous and more deadly. God help us all. Those SummerSlam victories for Brock Lesnar over Triple H and CM Punk, two men that no one would have bet against at the time, made it clear that it doesn't matter who the authority or WWE oh. universe may be. Et ça dure juste 14 pour le mec sur live, hein, quand même. C'est ultra hardcore. Man, that's the truth. The Beast doesn't care what's good for business or whether he's popular with the fans. He's just out there to win. Look out! to avoid that. Oh, he contre him. Great reversal. Oh, wait. Nice reversal. Oh, what an offensive move. Ah, Bray Wyatt is building some well-deserved momentum right now. Great match here, but if you missed any of the matches from this week, go to WWE.com to catch up on all the action. I go to WWE.com all the time to catch up on the Divas. We're looking at complete domination here. He's too busy bragging and boasting that. Oh, the that's 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 Diva. Just draining the shoulder of any strength that has left. Quit running your mouth and let them do this thing. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. Hop là, et de une. Lesnar Il a tout le kick. And now Lesnar begins to dominate. He's looking at it. Il a failli. Oh man. This one's over. You're right, Cole. Nobody gets up from an F5. No. And into the cover. Mm -hmm. Oh! I'm not sure I can watch this. The offense of Brock Lesnar is working well right now. Well, the trick sometimes when you get outside the ring is survival. The match becomes almost secondary when you get near all these dangerous objects. Hey! What's going on here? The ref's getting an airful is what's happening. Oh, his body has to be broken right now. Two. Lesnar seems competent here and with good reason. Three. Oh, man, is he fired up. This Bray Wyatt really creeps me out. Oh, out of nowhere. I'd say that's more embarrassing than anything else what a reversal oh wait nice reversal we're looking at complete domination here remember momentum in wwe can turn on a dime and leave you some change Uh-oh, big move coming. Not this. He's looking at it again. He had five. This one's over. You're right, Cole. Nobody gets up from an F5. Oh, makes the cover. One, two, three. Oh, no. Man, he's got to feel great. I can't believe what we just saw. Highlight after highlight. Et bien voilà, on va se retrouver pour le main event. Oh, 
Voilà. Here's your winner, Brock Lesnar. An amazing contest comes to a close following a decisive pinfall victory. Impressive doesn't even begin to describe his performance here tonight, Michael. That was a thing of beauty. It'll be interesting to see the fallout following this big singles win here tonight. Et eh bien voilà, on est parti pour le main event. Dilambos vs Triple H pour le World Heavyweight Champion de la WWE. Voilà. D'abord, j'ai pris Dilambos. Maintenant, imaginons que Dilambos gagne le titre en vrai. Qu'est-ce qui va se passer à vous se mener contre Triple H euh, Contre Human Reigns. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. And it is for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. Can you imagine what a win here would do for our challenger's career? A big fight feel here in the arena as the challenger gets ready for action. This match is going to be exciting. I can almost guarantee it. These are the type of matches that define careers. One on one for the gold.
Introducing the challenger from Cincinnati, Ohio, weighing in at 225 pounds, Dean Ambrose. And his opponent from Greenwich, Connecticut, weighing in at 255 pounds, he is the WWE World Heavyweight Champion, The Game Triple. Uh, we are seconds away from the start of this title match. And just like that, we're off and running. Both men know how big this championship match is. Even in these early moments, you can feel the excitement. This is going to be great. Dean Ambrose has taken control. This is the type of attack that just wears down an opponent. Yeah, and you can see it working right here. Look, we don't know what Dean Ambrose is going to do next. And you want a strategy? For anyone going up against Dean Ambrose, you have to be ready for anything. Because anything is what Dean Ambrose Alors, can do to him. Pas? And Triple H with a reversal. And that's because the game has a gift for getting out of trouble, Cole. Down goes the game. Yeah, but I don't anticipate Triple H staying down for long, Cole. He's doing everything he can to get his bearings back here. Otherwise, this match could be over sooner than him. anyone could have anticipated. Yeah, Cole, this is when you have to settle things down. Get the blood flowing back in your body and strategize what your next move or your next form of attack will be. You know, Michael, Ambrose is so out there, attacking him first might straighten him out. These competitors will always be looking to unleash their finishing maneuver, and when that happens, the complexion of the match can change in a heartbeat. You're right about that. The entire match can end in a heartbeat if somebody hits their big move. Well, like he says himself, things have to get worse before they can get better. That's what's happening right now. a different type of focus to punish an opponent like this. Yeah, you really have to enjoy He made it. He made it when I think about the history that Triple H has written in this career, it's amazing. I think back to his incredible entrance at WrestleMania 22 when he faced John Cena in Chicago. That procession to the ring set the tone for the rebound. Larry and Ambrose knows this one's just about over. Oh, Dean Ambrose, I'm telling you, this guy knows what to do in that ring. The game avoids trouble there. Yeah, Triple H saw that one coming a mile away. Oh, wait, nice reversal. He's going to take a chance here. Yeah, I don't know if this is going to be worth it or not. Man, he still, he takes to the air. Wow. Oh, look at the emotion. I'm not sure if he knows where he is right now. Attacking from the top. Ah, okay. you know, you spoke about WrestleMania 22, but let's think back to when the cerebral assassin truly took his first steps towards sports entertainment royalty when he defeated mankind in the finals of the 1997 King of the Ring tournament. You know what? Now that I think about it, I'm going to go with something historic that happened in 1997 as well. That summer, Triple H and the Heartbreak Kid formed the renegade group of D-Generation X. What about that, Cole? Of course. I mean, WWE wouldn't even have had an attitude error without them. And if you're not down with that, I got two for you. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. That's it. He's out. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. Two. 
Uh-oh, what is Dean Ambrose going to do here? Getting some air here! I need some too after sitting next to you. Oh, out of nowhere! It looked like his whole neck just crumbled there. Maneuvers like that put everybody in danger. No kidding, that's awful. I can't get over what we just saw. That was a great move. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Look out! Look out! And he comes crashing down. Oh, man. Every time you withstand force like that, it hurts bad. A reversal from Ambrose. Oh, that was slick. These guys are giving it absolutely everything they've got. They're not holding anything back, and I love it. Not today. Too fast. Just making his presence felt there. Here we go. That's vicious. Cutting off oxygen inflicts serious damage to an opponent. Hey, you could have until the referee's five count to break it. Use it. Look at this. This could be it. Vas-y, là, si tu te relèves. Ah oui. Mais imaginez, il se passe ça. Dynamo devient stupide. Devient... Qu'est-ce qui va se passer au oui, ce milieu Dynamo se fait Woman Wings pour la troisième fois. Pour le titre Ça peut être possible après, les gens. That match was incredible. was an incredible match. An incredible match and a big, big victory. But let's not forget, we have a... Bien, voilà, les gens, d'abord... Euh... Ah là, on a fini bah, le PVP. D'abord, euh, logiquement, si je dis pas de bêtises, comme j'ai dit au début de vidéo, ça sera euh, demain, logiquement. Sur le WG Network, d'abord, si vous n'êtes pas abonné ou quoi, ben, vous ne pourrez pas le regarder, malheureusement. Voilà. D'abord, logiquement, si je dis... D'ailleurs, il n'y aura pas de rediffusion pour les Français. Je ne suis pas au courant, par le droit de non. Parce que j'ai pu comprendre, non. Parce que personne n'est au courant, d'abord, je ne pense pas. Mais voilà. D'abord, ben, pour, ben, pour la prochaine vidéo de Kev, ben, ce sera WrestleMania, les gens. D'abord, il y a déjà plein de matchs qui seront déjà prêts. D'abord, Shane McMahon vs Undertaker, Triple H vs Woman Wings, logiquement où ça pourrait changer, et Dinombro, et, et Dinombro, Zvez, euh, Brock Lesnar, et puis il peut encore avoir d'autres matchs, que j'ai peut-être oublié, si et eh oui, et Charlotte Vess, euh, bah, de ça qui peut traiter, quoi, voilà. Bah voilà, les gens, on va s'arrêter d'abord pour la vidéo, parce qu'une heure et demie, quand même, ça va, c'est plus court que l'habitude, voilà, d'abord, euh, je peux récapituler les, les victoires et tout, premier match, Don Jude Vess, Bray Wyatt, euh, Bad News Barrett, et Sheamus euh, pour le titre euh, défaite d'abord euh, Sheamus c'est euh, Wade Barrett ont on les titres euh, Sami Zayn vs euh, Kevin euh, Kevin Owens pour les le, pour le titre à terre que total euh, ben, Sami Zayn vu qu'il a gagné Kalisto vs Reback pour le titre euh, 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 des États-Unis euh, j'ai gagné parce que j'étais Kalisto bon conservation de titre Brock Lesnar vs Bray Wyatt euh, j'ai gagné et Triple H vs Dinombros, ben j'ai gagné. J'ai gagné en étant euh, Dinombros et euh, nouveau, nouveau champion. Ben voilà, d'abord, on va s'éteindre. D'abord, si, si vous voulez vraiment acheter le jeu sur PC, le lien est dans la description. N'oubliez pas de mettre un j'aime, un commentaire, de vous abonner si ce n'est pas d'aller voir le site Instant Gaming. Et ça tout le monde.
was ill prepared. I was prepared to be ill, though. The skill was there. In the beginning, it wasn't about the ends, it was about busting raps and standing for something. For